Good morning, everybody. It is 7.20 and it is so gloomy outside. I just love it. Like I have the light on in here, it's so dark. So for breakfast, I just wanted a smoothie. So I wanted to show you guys these because I've talked about them on my Snapchat and my Instagram stories, but not in a video. And a lot of you guys have a lot of questions. So there are these smoothies from Daily Harvest that come in a like cup like this, which is so cool. Look at this little, they have a little straw insert. So you just pour the smoothie right back in here. But they're all the way full of fruit ingredients and you just add your liquid. So you add um, coconut milk, almond milk, coconut water, kind of, it recommends what one goes best. With these two, it's recommending almond milk. So I'm wondering which one to make. This one kind of sounds, I don't know, they both, sound kind of fall-ish. This one's avocado, cacao. This one, ha this is interesting because it has sweet potatoes. I'm gonna make this one because it just kind of, today's the first day of uh, fall, so let's do this. Let's see how this goes. Um, and I'm gonna talk to them and try to get you guys a coupon code if you wanna try it out. So if I get one, I will put it on the screen right here and also I will link it down below. Here's what the inside of this one looks like. So let's pour her in. So you can see you just get all your ingredients right there. And then you just add your it fits perfectly in there. And it, let me just say, it smells so good. I'm so excited to try the cacao. It tastes just like a pumpkin smoothie. It tastes so good. I'm so happy. This one was like the one I was nervous to try. This is actually my favorite. So let me show you the ingredients on the back. Banana, carrot, sweet potato, date, walnut, ginger. I think it's like the cinnamon and nutmeg and vanilla that makes it taste so good. But to check these out. Like, this is just so cool to me. I never want to cut up anything for smoothies, and this just, like, makes it so easy. So, yummy breakfast. Andrew and I went to get some coffee. I got a chai tea latte. This is my drink of choice now. I hadn't gotten anything from Starbucks for a long time, and, um... Chai just sounds so good to me now. I don't know, I'm trying to take that off. And I don't get it very often. This is probably like my fourth one that I've had since being pregnant and I'm six months pregnant now, which is crazy. Um, but yeah, it's so good and it tastes just like fall. It is 10.08 and I'm making an egg burrito. So this is all from Trader Joe's. We got some cheese, a flour tortilla. Flour tortillas don't irritate my stomach for those of you guys asking. This is kind of like the one thing I can eat that's not gluten-free, that doesn't really irritate me. But I have noticed since being pregnant, I don't really get stomach aches from eating gluten. Uh, but I start, that was kind of like when I was sick, so I think my body just really needed like anything to eat. But now that I can eat normally, I cut out all my gluten products again, except for flour tortillas, which have never been a problem in the first place. So, uh, two eggs, these are the organic eggs from Trader Joe's, and then some of this medium salsa. So, I'll cook this up. Here's my burrito, so I got the eggs, cheese down, some salsa, and salt and pepper. It is one o'clock, I'm having some lunch. This is leftover chili that I made yesterday. So in here, there's kidney beans, uh, let's see. Let's see if I can remember this. Kidney beans, baked beans, black beans, corn, salsa, crushed tomatoes. I put a little bit of barbecue sauce, ketchup, Cholula, a ton of seasoning, like salt, pepper, garlic. Uh, let's see. Red pepper flakes, chili powder, a little paprika, and I'm missing something, but... And then I just kind of let it sit. Oh, there's also ground turkey in here and then sauteed red onion. So that'll be my lunch. It's 4.45, I'm making a snack. So I'm going to have cucumber and hummus. This is the classic hummus from Trader Joe's. And this is like almost a full cucumber sliced up. I just love cucumber so much. And then this is from Trader Joe's too. It's leftovers. You literally just heat it up and I put a little bit of butter when I cook it. It's the multi-grain and mixed veggie. I think that's what it's called, something like that. Or like multi-grain spelts, I don't know. But it's in the freezer section and it's like a really great thing to just heat up really quick. And it's very, very filling. It's so good. I tried to make this one time like just from the ingredients that they have with just rice and like veggies, but it wasn't as good, so. And I'm also going to wash some of these tomatoes and have some of those with my hummus as well. 
I have to show you these because I tend to have these in a lot of my what I eat in a day videos. Had a couple of them, they're so good. So it is almost eight. I'm waiting for Andrew to get off work and we're gonna go to Yard House. So I will just have my phone with me, but I will film what I get for you guys. So I will see you there. These ones away too because they're just they're beautiful, but they're just so pigmented and bright that I just don't get, obviously I haven't even touched them yet, and I'll give more love to the, my Tarte blushes. So, um, here are two more from It Cosmetics. 